Hi everyone, this is Kamal from Extreme Excel Solutions. In this video, we'll see how to use regular expressions uh, in case of Excel. So, for example, I have a, a big list for addresses and I want to extract a particular information from these addresses. So, let's say I need to extract zip code for the time being. So, I need that in a separate field. So what I can do here is I can put a logic that I, if I see that uh, all the zip codes are of uh, obviously these are numerics so and their length is six characters so I can put some logic that anywhere if you find a six character or a six digit number uh, just put it uh, in a separate uh, column. So for that we'll be writing a function so I'm going to VB editor inserting a module and I'm going to create a function and I call it as get zip and I'll be passing the complete address as string to this one and so first of all let's create an object of regular expression so set re equals create object and vb script dot regexp so we need another uh, object where we'll be storing all the uh, pattern uh, all the matching results so i call it as dim all matches as object again here i define the pattern that re dot now uh, i know that uh, for zip codes my pattern would be uh, all uh, numerics I mean six digit numeric so I'll specify here re dot pattern equals now this pattern is uh, we basically use uh, this backslash T for numerics and here if you specify in curly brackets uh, a number it means that you are expecting a six digit number anywhere in uh, that particular string which you pass here so we can set uh, more properties here as well so these properties are like global we need to put it in double quotes so re dot global equals true and let's ignore the case sensitivity for the time being so I copy it and ignore case equals true now we have set the pattern we have set the properties now it's time to create an object for the matches which we find so I specify here all matches the object we have created all matches equal that comes from the pattern which we define so re dot execute we need to execute that pattern over to the string which we are expecting as input so here we specify the input if all matches dot count if it is not zero that means if we got something in that case we are going to print it somewhere so all matches dot item so for example you want to have uh, have the first occurrence of uh, any six digit number so you can 
specify the index as 0 then sub matches dot items 0 now because we need to return this value in the same cell because we have created a function or a macro so the function uh, return argument will be like this so let's say we use it we save it in a variable like this and return result here so this is it now if I go back to my Excel sheet and I use get zip function and pass the address here like this uh, there must be something wrong with the pattern only so we need to see the pattern oh, okay basically these brackets are yeah now if I run it here is a pen for first now if I copy the formula you will see that in one go we have all the zip codes so similarly you can use this regular expression to find or extract your meaningful information by applying some patterns to your string thank you very much for watching this tutorial uh, if you have not yet subscribed to our channel please uh, subscribe and you'll be getting more frequent updates regarding our video tutorials thank you goodbye